Hi, welcome to SBR Sports Picks. My name is Peter Lozak. It's week four in the NFL. Today is Tuesday, September 26th. We are talking with Big Al McMorty from BigAl.com about a couple of games to go this Sunday in the NFL. The first game we talked about involved uh, two teams coming off a loss, Pittsburgh and Baltimore. And now we're going to talk about another interesting game with uh, two good teams also, each coming off a loss, Oakland against uh, Denver. Uh, sharp action supposedly came in on uh, on uh, Washington last week, fading Oakland, and that sharp action was totally right. Oakland uh, looked completely uh, out of sorts uh, in that game. They're obviously not that bad of a team. Denver, on the other side, uh, you know, they they lost to uh, to the Bills. They did outgain the Bills, and uh, it was just uh, you know turnovers that were the problem there. Trevor Simeon uh, came into that game you know looking great looking completely on fire and uh and now it's looking like he uh, regressed in a major way not sure what to expect from him here it's an interesting matchup obviously uh both teams are better than what they showed last week the line is a split it's a uh, denver at home minus two and a half or three who do you like more to bounce back here al yeah you know, well i think in afc west divisional games i'm always going to look for uh, the road team, you know, and I mean, here's a stat for you. I don't think a lot of people know this statistic, but in AFC West division games going all the way back to 1980, the road underdogs are 120 wins, 78 losses against a spread off a straight up loss, including 63 and 32 ATS if their opponent is also off a defeat. So that's the situation here. So I'm definitely going to grab the points with Oakland. The other interesting thing to note is that 666 win percentage teams were better. They've cashed 61% since 1980 as road underdogs off a loss by 14 or more points. So I think this is a really good bounce back situation for Oakland. Taking a look at the Denver side of the ledger, you know, everyone thinks that Denver's got this great uh, home field advantage, but of late, Denver's really been a, you know, poor in certain spots at home, including when they're, when they're home favorites versus opponents off a loss. Denver is 12 and 29 ATS their last 41, including one in 10 ATS if the Broncos are off a loss themselves. So I think you're going to get value here with Oakland plus the three points. I'm going to take the points with the Raiders. All right. That sounds good. Plus three minus 115 right now. And yeah, that jives with uh, my general sense on this game, which is just that uh, Simeon struggles from last week. I think we're more likely to see, uh, you know, a repeat of that than we will are likely to see a repeat of uh, Oakland struggles uh, from last week as a team in general. Oakland plus three minus 115 is Al McMorty's pick for the Oakland Denver game. Interesting stuff, Al. Give a plug for your website, BigAl.com. Sure, Peter. Uh, I've been in business since 1992. Folks can go to BigAl.com and get four free plays every single day. Two for myself, one from Larry Ness, one from Scott Spritzer. And if you want to get our best selections, just go to the website and click on Picks for Sale. And then we have weekly, monthly, six-month, and annual packages, too. Just go to BigAl.com and click on subscriptions. Last season in football, up 64.80 stars on our top-rated plays in college and pro. And we'll do it again this year. Awesome, Al. Thanks, Al. Thanks, Peter. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to our channel. Now we've put a lot of work into producing all these free videos, so please help us out and keep all our content free for you forever by simply liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing. Now not to mention a visit to our industry leading website will warm the hearts of all our SBR employees, especially myself. Now the links are over there to the left, uh, so do check those out. Thanks for watching.